This problem, we're given a number in decimal form, or base 10, and we're asked to convert it to base 3. So the way we'll do this is we'll just keep dividing by 3 as follows. And we'll pay special attention to the remainders. Okay, so 8, 4, 0, 7, and we'll divide this by 3. So if you put this in your calculator, let's see, 8, 4, 0, 7, divided by 3. I got 2, 8, 0, 2, point 3, and it repeats. So to find the remainder, you just take this number and multiply it by 3. So point 0.3 times 3, point 0.3 times 3, or rather point, like point 0.33 times 3, you get point 0.99, right, which is basically going to be 1. So the remainder here is 1. Then you do it again. You take this number and divide by 3. 2802 divided by 3. So this is, let's see, 2802 divided by 3. So I got 934. Okay, 934. And there's no remainder. So if you wanted to show the work, you could do 0, 0.0 and then do 0, 0.0 times 3. And you see the remainder is 0. Then we do it again, 934, let's just take this one and divide it by 3. So 934 divided by 3, I got 311.333, so 311.33, and it repeats. Same thing, you do 0.33 times 3, that gives you 1. So the remainder is 1. Then you do it again, 311 divided by 3. Right, just keep taking this one, keep dividing by 3, and keep finding the remainder. So 311 divided by 3 is 103.66, and it's repeating. So you do 0.66 times 3. I just put 0.66 in my calculator and multiply by 3, and I got like 1.98. So this is pretty much 2. Okay, so you just round. Then you do it again. 103 divided by 3. So 103 divided by 3. I got 34.33 repeating. So you just do 0.33 times 3, which is 1. Boom. Do it again. <laughs> 34 divided by 3. So 34 divided by 3 is 11.33. So 0.33 times 3 is 1. Then you do it again. Take 11 divided by 3. Long problem. Going fast. Sorry. This is 11 divided by 3. This is 3.66. Then you do 0.66 times 3, and that gives you 2. Almost there, right? Almost there. Then you do 3 divided by 3, you get 1.0. So you do 0 times 3, so you get 0. So that's the, that's the remainder. Then you take the 1. you got to keep going until there's no whole part. So you do 1 divided by 3. That's going to be 0 0.33. So you do 0.33 times 3 to figure out the remainder, which is 1. And so the final answer, read them backwards, 1, 0, 1, 0, 2, 1, 1, 2, 1, 1, 2, 1, 0, 1. So it would be 1, 0, 2, 1, 1, 2, 1, 0, 1. 1, 0, 2, 1, 1, 2, 1, 0, 1. And this is in base 3.